hello everybody how's everybody doing we're at cvs today and um we're i'm gonna start off with that spin 40 get the ten dollar extra care bug deal i'm gonna start off with that but i wanted to say have y'all noticed that the crts have reverted back to just basic crts i'm tending to find out that if you have switched cards on your phone like put in one um, account and then switch back to the other account they figure you have more than one cvs account and your crts will come and go because the two other two accounts that i have where I, they stay on one device my husband's card stays on his and then i started a new card that stays on my son's ipad those get different crts and they're starting to get more crts because i'm doing different deals but yes when you start a new card do not put it on your device because the crts will eventually leave so just keep that in mind that's what i believe anyway now if you've um moved your cards in between each other on your phone and your crts are the same put a comment in the description box because then i'm wrong but I noticed that the two accounts that I've switched in on my phone um, are back to no CRTs, just basic CRTs, like 4 off of 25 um, oral care, 4 off of 30 shave. I'm, that's all the CRTs I'm getting again on those two cards. Are your cards doing that again? Let me know in, in the comments. Now let's get started. Pantene this week is three for 12 and it is also part of the spin 40 get a $10 extra care buck. I'm gonna pick up three of them. I'll use the digital coupon on the app, $3 off of three. And I'm gonna pair that with a digital booster by $12 with the Pantene, save $2, CRT and the paper booster, sorry, the paper coupon from the PNG. I'll use that with it and I'll show you all of those coupons in just a second. Okay, for my Pantene, there's my three off of three coupon from the PNG. And these are some of the coupons I have, a four off of 25, um, three off of 18, which I'm not sure I'm gonna use that. I have a three off of three, nail care, hair care, or hair color product that I'm definitely gonna use. And then I have this two off of 12 Pantene Aussie. And I think I'm going to use that one. There's my $3 Pantene Digital that I'll use with that also. I'm over by the Axe Deodorant because that's also part of the Spin 40. Get the $10 extra but care buck. And at my store, the price is $7.29. Buy one, get one 50% off. At $7.29, buy one, get one half off. That'll be $11.03. I'm gonna use this $3 off of two insert coupon from the Unilever. And I have a CRT for $3 off of a $10 Axe Stick Deodorant. The digital I used last week doing a deal on Saturday. I don't have that to use. So all that'll be is $4 off. I'll pay $7 out of pocket. And then I'm going to redeem for a dollar back for each of those on Ibotta. It won't be, but it's also included in the spend deal. But after those coupons, I will have an out of pocket of $7. I'm over by the clear all hair color. There are two for 15 and you get back a $2 extra care buck. Well, I have the $6 off of two coupon that I wanna use, plus a free box of hair color. I'm hoping that they both glitch together or at least go together, I'm hoping. And um, it'll be free, plus it counts towards beauty. Okay, here's my first deal, y'all. I ended up buying three boxes because of the coupons I had. And here's everything. It ended up being free after all of the coupons. I had a six off of two Clairol, a $3 off of one, that free box of Clairol, it took off $9, the three off of three Clairol hair color and a $2 extra care bug. My, left my subtotal zero, a dollar 11 after tax. And I got back two extra care bucks for purchasing that deal, for doing the buy two Clairol. And, at $15 and get back a $2 extra care buck. Mm -hmm. So net cost, just free. And my $2 ECB adjusted down. So it's like an even exchange. I received this eight off of 40 on my next purchase. And since part of my spin 40, get the $10 extra care bucks, $20 of that have other threshold CRTs attached to it. So I'm gonna pick up four of the Tide 
pods and the herbal essence. The herbal essence is two for 12. And when we spend 15, we're gonna get a $5 extra care buck. I'm gonna grab those two, and then I'm gonna walk over to the head and shoulders. It is also two for 12 and part of the same deal. And that'll put me at $24, well over the spend 15. Okay, here's everything I got. I got two deals going on. Spend 15 on select hair care, get a $5 extra care buck. And then the spend 40, get a $10 extra care buck. All together, my total is $66.76 for all of these items. We're gonna have a glitch going on right here with the head and shoulders. $3 insert coupon from the PNG, $3 digital. $3 insert coupon for the Herbal Essence, $3 digital for that. I'm using an eight off of 40, no other threshold coupons for this. All of these items together total about $42. So that'll be good for that. For each of the tied detergents, well, Tide Pods, I have $2 insert coupons from the PNG. I do believe there is a digital we can use on the app also. The X, I have a $3 off of two coupon that I'm gonna use. I've already used the digital on this account. I did a deal Saturday, and then I'm gonna use the three off of 10 CVS CRT for this. The Pantene, I'll use the three off of three insert coupon from the PNG, the three off of three digital, the three off of three select hair care, and a two off of 12. The two off of 12 and the three off of 10 threshold coupons for the X and the Pantene. I'm also gonna do the spend 12 on Noxzema Pond Simple Facial Care and get a $4 extra care buck. I'm gonna pick up the Pond's Cold Cream for $6.49. Next, I'm gonna pick up the St. Ives Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub for $5.79. Total for everything is $12.28. I'ma subtract that three off of two insert coupon from the Unilever, the three off of two digital on the app, and I have a two off of St. Ives Ponds or Simple Facial Care CRT. After all of those coupons, I'll pay $4.28 out of pocket and I'll get back a $4 extra care buck, and that's $12 towards beauty. I'm gonna do this scope deal right here, buy two at $5.29 and get a $5 extra care buck back. Then I'm going to pick up three Crest toothpaste at $3.99. And when you buy three of those, you get a $5 extra care buck back. Then I'm gonna grab two of the CVS toothbrushes at $1.79 each. Here's everything I'm picking up for this deal. And the CVS toothbrushes are $179. Buy one, get one 50% off, which is better. My total for everything comes to $25.14. I have a five off of three Crest Digital on the app. I have a $1 digital for the scope. I'm gonna have to run out to my car and get the $1 paper coupon from the PNG for my second scope mouthwash. I have a three off of 10 scope. CRT, it's Scope Oral-B or Crest product CRT. I have a three off of 15 toothpaste mouthwash or toothbrushes CRT. And then I have that $1 Crest um, digital that hopefully will glitch. If all of those coupons comes off, I'll pay $11.14 out of pocket for all of these items, but I'll get back five ECBs for purchasing the two Crest and five e extra care bucks for purchasing the three crust toothpaste. Nothing back for the CVS um, toothbrushes. Just had to throw those in there so I can use my CRTs. I'm over by the Hallmark items because I have two $3 off of two CRTs. And I think I'm just gonna grab something different. That gift bag right there, the princess gift bag. And then I'll pick up this Superman gift bag. And here they go. One of them are priced at $2.99. The other one is priced at $3.49. That'll leave me a total to pay 48 cents for both of these gift bags after these two CRTs, which I think is not bad. Okay, for the first half of my spend 40, I got the three Pantene and the two X. And here's this receipt. I couldn't put them, and this is everything. I couldn't put it all together because my threshold CRTs would not come off all together, even though I met the threshold limit for them. 
these are all of the Pantene and Axe products I picked up for that spend 40 get the $10 extra care buck back the first $3 off of two coupon is the Axe the second three off of two is the Pantene that is the $3 digital for the Pantene that is my three off of three hair care CRT three off of 10 Axe hair care C deodorant CRT two off of 12 Pantene hair care CRT and then I used five dollars in extra care bucks and a baby buck. That left my subtotal ninety-two cents, two fifty-six after tax, and I just got a two cent baby buck back because that was the first half of my spend forty. The tide was my second half of the spend forty, and of course I went about three dollars over that. It was about forty-two dollars and some change um, for that deal, and then I did the spend 15 on select hair care get a five dollar extra care buck back here are all of those items right there there is my three dollar off of two digital for the head and shoulders my three off of two digital for the herbal essence my four coupons for the tide and your store may not let you use the four consecutive coupons for the tide um, each store is different my store lets you use four like coupons as long as it doesn't beep there's my three off of two digital for the herbal essence, my three off of two digital for the head and shoulders, my eight off of 40 purchase, and I use $12 in extra care bucks. On this card, I don't have a lot of extra care bucks. And my subtotal is $3.76, $5.89 after tax. I got back eight cents in baby bucks, a $10 extra care buck for spending 40, and then a $5 extra care buck for spending 15 on hair care. And that is how that transaction went. Okay, here's this transaction. Y'all, I am not used to doing big transactions. I'm used to doing um, little transactions like St. Ives and Ponds, the Crest toothpaste, then the Crest mouthwash, and then the bags, the Hallmark deal. But I did it all at one time. It didn't work out. I'm going to have to try to get used to it and making sure my math is on point. I guess my math was not on point, and I'm going to show you why. Because... Here is all of the items I picked up. You see the scope items, St. Ives, Ponds, and a Hallmark. There's my $1 manufacturing coupon for the scope. My $3 coupon for the three off of two for the St. Ives and Ponds. I had the five off of three for the oral care products. My $3 off of two digital for the St. Ives and the Ponds products. My dollar for the Crest toothpaste came off. My three off of 15 for the Oral Care did come off. My two off of 10 for the Crest Scope and Oral B products did not come off, although it should have come off because my, where's the scope? Was priced at $5.29 each, which was over $10. So that should have come off. Then I had the three, two, three off of two Hallmarks. They came off, and my two dollar off of St. Ives Ponds or um, what is that? The other one, CRT came off. I used sixteen dollars in extra care bucks and four cent baby buck. My subtotal was three ninety five. It should have been a dollar ninety five if that two dollar off of ten. Um, CRT had come off for the crust. So I don't know if my math was off or what. The only thing I'm thinking is my math was off. But I did get back an eight cents baby buck, a five dollar extra care buck for purchasing the two crust and scope and oral B, four dollars for spending twelve on the ponds and St. Ives, and then I got a five dollar extra care buck for purchasing the three crust, three white toothpaste, and a three dollar beauty buck for last week purchase. There was nothing for the Hallmark bags. I just wanted a good deal. The only thing I could think of, if I had known that two off of 10 CRT was not gonna come off, I probably would have broke up my transactions, but it is what it is. And I'm trying to do more bigger um, transactions because I just don't have all day to stand at CVS and do a bunch of small ones. But although um, I'm at, it didn't work out like I planned, it was still a this great deal. This is everything I picked up today. Just remember, I bought it for your ex. 
scan your receipt to fetch rewards for the Pond, St. Ives, and Axe. And I think that is about it. And you guys, I try to get my math as close as I can when I'm in the store, but I fly by the seat of my pants and I'm hurrying up trying to add up everything. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. But because there are so many CVS couponers in my area, I actually have to go into the store and see what I have. I can't just actually plan my hauls because they never go accordingly because the items are not in the store. With that being said, you guys have a great week and I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace.